It's very exciting to visit Berlin. It's been on my bucket list forever. Living in South Africa is obviously a very different experience to living in Amsterdam or Berlin. South Africa is a lot more conservative. Here, there's a sense of tremendous freedom amongst the people. It's visually quite overwhelming for me. Yes, it's quite intense and I feel it's got a, like a pop culture and quite a grungy vibe. But it's very cool. Woo, don't want to get run over. <laughs> I'm not really precious about how I work. I work with dirty water and whatever's in the studio. I look at a lot of fashion. I look at a lot of um, imagery online. Sometimes I'll paint from a photograph of a friend. But they're generally very strong women. Women who believe in themselves. Women who have got the confidence to really be who they are. They're self-assured and they're a little bit edgy and a little bit sexy and they're comfortable. At the end of the day, I don't think enough people are happy. But I want my artwork to either make you feel something or make you smile. Empowering people to just think and step out and realize that it's not that bad. I generally um, do my sketch and then I like to paint upside down so that I'm not following a form. I'm just I'm following negative space. I'm not so precious about what I'm doing when I'm working upside down. In art, I don't think there's ever really a, a mistake. If you feel that it's not quite right, you just sort of work around it. I never want my work to feel overworked. I like it to feel spontaneous. I let the paints bleed into each other. I let it take its own shape. Every day, draw something, illustrate something, sketch something, paint something, practice. So that you understand the medium that you're working with, you understand the subject that you're working with. My advice is really to practice. That's the only way you're going to move forward. <laughs> Lucky you don't have monkeys here. They come into my house all the time. Really? Inside mm, the house? Inside. Monkeys? Monkeys! What yes. Like the, the little uh, vervet, the little oh, grey ones. Place, I paint them all the time. And they're so naughty, but they are amazing to paint, their expressions, their movement. It's always fun. Mm -hmm.